Hello all, it's your girl Tiffany, Madam Luscious Black Beauty, your Poetic Psychic Pisces, High Priestess, aka the light that shines like a diamond. Also known as your modern day nun. One whom isn't within a coven, a convent, or a covenant. I do thank you all for listening and for watching on tonight. If you would be so kind to please like, share, and subscribe, it would be greatly, greatly appreciated. This is going to be a general reading for the overall collective of any zodiac sign. So please take the messages that apply, leave the ones that do not. And without any further ado, guys, we're going to get into um, tonight's reading. Remember that this reading can apply to your past, your present, or your future, as well as it may be pertaining to you, your lover, your family, your friends, your co-workers, your neighbors, honey, complete strangers, or any and everyone in between that you may or may not know. I have pre-shuffled a couple decks, okay, so we can try to um, get this reading done a little bit faster, okay? So the first message you have here, okay, is she believed she could, so she did. Let your faith be bigger than your fear. So with this energy, spirit is telling you to, um, that you can do anything that you put your mind to, okay? All you got to do is keep trying, don't worry, okay? Take a chance on yourself in something that you're thinking about doing or that you're currently doing. Just don't give up. Spirit also wants you to know that you um, are important, that you matter, okay? Okay. Spirit is telling you to be that change that you want to see in the world, okay? Um, this also says to make your own kind of music. Whomever you are, you may or may not be into actual music, okay? But whomever you are, you're a free agent, which means you're an independent artist, okay? So you can be an up-and-coming artist, you can be a starving artist, but you're a free agent. You're an independent artist, which means you're not signed to anyone or under some type of contract or something okay so you can spirit wants you to be you okay and also be that change don't be afraid to be the change that you want to see in the world okay um so if you are into music this could be any kind of music whether it be blues or pop or rap r&b rock country whatever okay but you're a free agent you're an independent artist i feel like you enjoy being independent okay although um it does take a lot more work and a lot more effort and think when you're doing things on your own. However, um, I feel like you enjoy it, okay? So the next energy we have here is book nerd. Whomever you are, um, you could be smart, okay? Really intuitive. You may, you, this could talk about someone who is excelling, someone who has a high IQ, um, someone who is illuminated or you like to study or read, okay? You're definitely someone who is awakened, okay? Um, you're very smart, though, whether you consider yourself to be particularly smart, okay? You're actually very smart here. Um, this energy, you know, also has that geek squad kind of energy to it, okay? Um, so you could be someone who is into education or you're educated or have a diploma or degree of some kind. Um, you could be into tech or trade or just work hard, okay? But you're focused. Um, this also can speak to someone who is a college student, okay? Okay. Um, it speaks to success, a scholar, or even reading, okay? Um, but there's that book nerd type of energy. Um, but if you're not into, like, reading or studying a lot or anything, if there's something about you and what you do that's very awakened, you're very illuminated, and because of that, Spirit is saying that you're smart. Okay, so we have here, take the risk or lose the chance here, but do so with caution, okay? So I feel like you're going to be, there's going to be some life changes that's happening for you. You're going to be taking um, calculated leaps of faith, okay? Um, not blind, careless, reckless leaps of faith, but you're going to be taking a risk. You're going to be taking leaps of faith, okay? You're doing so with caution and carefully, okay? You're doing something new, okay? You could be moving forward um, in your life. Okay, and last but not least here, Spirit is telling you to do something today that your future self will thank you for here, okay? That sits here with the High Priestess energy. So like I said, you're someone who is um, highly intuitive, naturally psychic, okay? You could be empathic, okay? But um, because... Of the fact that you're illuminated that you're awakened um you hold some type of secret knowledge or secret information okay i feel like you're on this mission to awaken the world um you're into healing others um making a difference okay um you could be into doing something that saves or rescue others okay or someone in particular here okay um you're the type of person to who helps the less fortunate you give back to your community okay you teach and guide those in need okay 
and you make a stand for something great, okay? Or you plan to do so, okay? So the card that you have at the bottom of the deck here, um, this says, I am the one thing in life I can control, okay? And Spirit wants you... Um, so it's telling you don't give up always reach for the stars and i definitely feel like you're somebody who shines very brightly like a star okay this talks about your career your choices okay spirit wants you to know that you can do it okay continue to practice continue to shine bright okay keep up the good work even when you're not getting that pat on the back or or that uh, a round of applause or um good job from anybody else okay continue to shine bright and keep up the good work okay because spirit is saying that you are doing a great job Spirit wants you um, either to continue on your, your, you know, your destined path, okay? Step into your life purpose if you haven't already, okay? Um, this also speaks to some type of popularity or you coming into some type of popularity, okay? But Spirit, um, overall, Spirit wants you to follow your hopes, wishes, dreams, and desires, okay? To fulfill your destiny, okay? Um, and behind that, we have here, stay true to yourself and your beliefs here, Okay? Um, once again, this talks about your hopes, wishes, and dreams. You're someone who's a 100% real, okay? This talks about your goals, your heart's desires, your passions, okay? Um, your creativity, um, what you love here, okay? But you're staying true to yourself and your beliefs here, okay? Okay, guys, so let's um, clarify. I have a few decks, that, uh, other decks here that I already pre-shuffled for you all, okay? Okay. Um, so when I clarified, um, she believed she could, so she did. Let your faith be bigger than your fear. And I just want you to, I just want to say that this message could be for a feminine or a masculine. Okay, just because you see feminines on my cards here, my individual cards, it doesn't mean it's solely just for a feminine, okay? Because there could be a masculine who this energy is resonating for as well. Okay. So we have privileged lady here. Whomever you are, you're either already a privileged lady or you're stepping into a position um, into being a privileged lady, okay? And it's because you believed in yourself, okay? You believed that you could do something and you strive to do that, okay? You allowed your faith to be bigger than your fear, okay? You're coming into some type of unexpected income as well. There could be somebody who wants to invest in you. But this talks about you generating an income of some kind from the work that you're doing here okay this definitely has something to do with your occupation what you do for work whether you're doing this as a hobby uh, a talent a skill or ability a trade um an actual career field a job okay um you're being that change that you want to see in the world you're making your own kind of music here through this occupation that you have through the work that you do here okay and it is going to bring you great fortune spirit is saying okay so this is the reason why spirit do not want you to give up okay keep moving forward okay to clarify book nerd here there's uh, this talks about a change okay so there's going to be some type of shift some type of change that is happening that is coming into your life okay and i feel like all of these things tie in together everything kind of interconnect with each other this change definitely has to do with this work that you're doing okay definitely which definitely has to do with this this uh income that is coming in to you okay you've literally gone from unexpected income to great fortune to sudden wealth here okay which is what is happening for you because of whatever work that you do okay you're obviously very good at whatever you're doing in your life okay you're going you have chose to go down this destined pathway okay it is your destiny this is your life purpose okay as you can see your pathway is clear the light shines bright is, is shining brightly through this pathway here okay and this door is open for you okay you're going down your destined pathway but you're doing so with caution okay even though you're doing something new here you could be traveling or getting ready to travel taking some type of trip or journey or, or what have you as well um, as it relates to this pathway in which you are on in the distant horizon here, which talks about the very new future, um, I feel like you're already doing really great things, okay? But you're going to do something. Um, Spirit is telling you to do something today that your future self would thank you for. I feel like you've already been doing those things. So in the very near future, Spirit is saying that you're coming into a position of high honor, okay? This could be you receiving some type of... Um, scholarships, recognitions, rewards accolades, 
plaques, medals, um, anything like that, okay? But you're stepping into a position of high honor, okay? For whomever is resonating with this message here, you have some type of gift, okay? You have some type of divine gift, okay? Which is what you use to um, assist you in the work that you do here. And because of that, I do feel like that there's some type of gifts that's coming in to you. I feel like this could be donations coming into you. This could be, but it's unexpected income that is coming into you. I feel like persons may want to give you but I also feel like you have a gift as well, okay? Yeah, there's definitely some type of messages, news, information, and communication that is coming in for you as well from someone, okay? But whomever you are and whatever you do um, as it relates to your occupation, you are a messenger yourself, okay? The gift that you have, um, you use that to be a messenger unto others, okay? To bring people divine messages about certain things, okay? So we also have here faithfulness, okay? Um, one who is faithful is loyal, okay? I feel like you're faithfully dedicated and loyal to what it is that you do, okay? Um, and it makes your work, it makes your skill, your ability, your creativity, okay? All the more better because you're faithfully dedicated to what you are doing here, okay? Now, these life changes that's happening for you, these leaps of faith that you're taking, this new pathway in which you are on is leading you directly to fortunes, great fortune here. This is not just some chump change, just some, some you know, money here, okay? This is fortunes here, okay? And a lot of it, okay? Um, something that you're doing very great you coming into this high honor okay is gonna have a lot of people talking with the conversation here a lot of people are gathered up together and and maybe whispering your name and saying your name and in and, and talking um about the fact that you're getting this high honor and you're coming up in society and different things like that sorry guys i had to get a drink honey y'all ain't understand that dog on Minute Maid Fruit Punch Child is so good. Whew, especially when it's like ice cold. My goodness. Okay, that was a, just a real quick side note. <laughs> a little juice plug there. Okay. Um, okay, guys. So at the bottom of the deck, we have community. We have cheerfulness. Okay. Um, also at the bottom of this deck here, uh, we have firm foundation. You definitely will have a, a firm foundation. Um, doing what you do what you do I, I feel like you're striving towards this firm foundation okay being very grounded stable and secure okay in the very near future um it's going to cause for a cheerfulness joyfulness happiness maybe even celebration okay but whomever you are i feel like it's you know i <laughs> It's a, it, it's, it will be an exciting time, okay? It'll be an hur a hooray type of moment. But I feel like um, you have this very humbled approach to what it is you're doing. So I don't I don't feel like that you will just like cut loose, bust it wide open, and, and tell them bring it back or nothing, okay? And, be, you know, be, be ready to wow out and, you know, party like a rock star or nothing like that. But, um, you know... It's a moment to be proud of. You definitely may, you know, do something humble, like, you know, have a nice meal, have a good drink, you know, um, pat yourself on the back type of thing here, okay? And the community will be watching, um, watching you as you do this, okay? So to clarify, she believes she could, so she did. Let your faith be bigger than your fear. We have truth here. Whomever you are, you are the truth. You speak the truth, okay? There you bring some type of truth or clarity with this gift that you have. And because of this, somebody wants to be uh, gifting or giving unto you, okay? With this unexpected income, okay? To clarify, be this change that you want to see in the world. Make your own kind of music. We have foundation and achievement. So I feel like what you're working on, what you're doing, um, and this great fortune coming in from that, like I said, is going to grant you some type of firm foundation as for your achievements, okay, and your accomplishments, okay? 
And so to clarify book nerd here, okay, you being awakened, you being illuminated, you being smart, you excelling, okay, we have recognition and reward. So like I said, you're coming into some type of recognition, okay, um, you're getting some type of honor, high honor for something, okay, there's this public recognition and reward or some type of recognition and reward that you're seeing you see how this person is humble bowing thank you you know um showing gratitude and a gracious gesture for this recognition and this reward in which you are receiving okay to clarify um life changes and you know taking that risk and taking leaps of faith we have spiritual strength here okay so i definitely feel like you could be a spiritualist you could be a realist okay but there has been this spiritual growth within you okay thus you have this very firm spiritual strength okay as you go down your destined pathway as you go along on this journey okay as you walk into a very fortunate um prominent time in your life okay and as i said in the in the near future you're coming into some type of high honor that everyone is going to be talking about okay and you are going to be able to finally rejoice in a celebration because of this okay very beautiful energy guys So let's get some Terra on this and see what's going on. Yeah, so we have the Ace of Swords here. You are the truth. You speak the truth, okay? The the there's just the cold hard truth, okay? Whether it's good, bad, or indifferent. You speak the truth, you are the truth. And um this gift that you have, you magnificently deliver the truth okay this also can talk about you receiving some type of truth or clarity about something as well spirit clarify um oh goodness so you have a lot of people who are in competition with you there could be people who are jealous of you who are envious of you who are in this tug of war back and forth push and pull with you um it is interesting because I feel like people are competing with you, but you are not competing with them, okay? But Spirit is saying that you continue to be the change that you want to see in the world. You're making your own kind of music, and people are jealous of this and envious of this and competing with you, okay? But Spirit is saying you're the magician. You're the one who have all the tools to manifest what it is that you want to manifest in your life, okay? So you continue to work hard no matter how many people are in competition with you, Um you continue to work hard. You continue to stay in your lane. You continue to do what you do. And because of this, you're coming into some type of... Your hopes, wishes, and dreams are coming true is what's happening, okay, um, in the near future. And this is happening with you receiving some type of... Um, with you receiving some type of recognition and reward, okay? Spirit clarified life changes, leaps of faith, taking risk. Yeah, I feel like you, yeah, I just seen, it went back in the deck. I just seen judgment. I feel like you have made the ultimate judgment and decision to continue to move forward, to strive to be the greatest version of yourself, okay? And because of this, there is abundance that is coming in for you, okay? Happiness, abundance, new beginnings, okay? Which will bring you fulfillment as well, okay? As you continually to as you continue to grow spiritually stronger and stronger as you you know persist ahead spirit clarify um do something today that your future self will thank you for i feel like a lot of people tried to leave you out in the cold or did leave you out in the cold left you hanging left you in lack and worry and stress and sadness um in need of assistance people turned their back on you um a lot of people did you dirty, okay? But you continue to move forward anyway, okay? 
Spirit, clarify, um, do something today that your future self would thank you for. Okay, so we have here the Ace of Cups. This talks about emotional fulfillment here, okay? You're definitely, I feel like in the near future, when you receive some type of high honor, not only will this be emotional fulfillment, but you will, um, I feel like you will be very emotional by this to the point of having extreme feelings and overwhelming emotions. It may be, um, very overwhelming for you. Maybe you haven't ever reached such accomplishment before in your life, okay? Yeah, and it's because you're stepping into some type of success, triumph, and victory here, okay? Public recognition even, okay? That's bringing you some type of firm foundation. Okay, guys, let's see what other messages Spirit has. For you all, and we're going to get some Archangel messages, and we're going to wrap this reading up. For whoever this for, this is very beautiful energy. I do see a lot of people who want to cause conflict for you, who want to try to throw obstacles in your way, who want to plot, plan, and scheme against you. But we're going to, in this reading, we're going to focus on um, what you're doing, what you're working on, Okay. Because these persons who are competing with you, who want conflict with you, who are jealous and envious of you, who hate you, who want to try to stop you, block you, hinder you, halt you, and different things like that, you know, they're going to do them, okay? These persons could be very hostile towards you even, okay? Spirit, give us clear and accurate messages as it relates to the yeah a lot of people you even have with when i split the deck you even have the five of fire here and the ten of water here you have a lot of family supposed family who are causing conflicts for you okay these people have caused you like several annoyances okay they're competing with you they're jealous of you they're envious of you your own family you would think this would be a group of a bunch of strangers okay but your own family has like really made your life a living hell this is crazy okay spirit please give us clear and accurate messages some type of offer could be coming into you once again we have the nine of water hopes wishes dreams happiness okay you could be the empress here okay so you could be a mother or a mother figure here okay the empress speaks to creation abundance action okay also as well as you've been a mother or a mother figure okay the empress is usually someone who is seen as nurturing and loving and caring and giving affectionate and uh, generous okay and all those loving nurturing motherly things okay with the Ace of Fire here, this talks about opportunity, creativity, action, okay? Passionate movement forward. You taking action in your life here, okay? Yes, you coming into a large lump sum of money in abundance. Once again, prosperity, security, tradition, okay? A large windfall of money, financial stability, and security, okay? And we have the sun here, which talks about success, recognition, enthusiasm, happiness, abundance, new beginnings, fulfillments, fresh starts, second chances, okay? Joy, peace, harmony, okay? All of those lovely, wonderful things, okay? Yeah, with the ace of air at the bottom of the deck, spirit is saying that this is truth, that this is clarity, that you are inspiration with your communication, okay? Okay? And there are adjustments that are being made to your life, no matter who dislikes you, no matter who is working against you. Okay, guys. So, Spirit, please give us clear and accurate messages from the Archangels to clarify this reading. So bottom of the deck, we have the Knight of Gabriel here. You're somebody who is confident, enthusiastic, courageous, and charismatic here, okay? Um, you're taking action in your life here, okay? You have great passion for a cause, okay? You are instinctively knowing just what to do. You always instinctively know just what to do, okay? 
So with the six of Gabrielle here, Spirit is saying congratulations, you've done a wonderful job. Time to move on to the next project, awards, scholarships, or promotions. I told you, you're getting some type of recognition or reward here, okay? We have the 10 of Gabrielle here, okay? Archangel Gabrielle is really coming through for you, okay? Um, we have here, ask your angels for helpful people to lighten your load working too many hours trying too hard to please others here okay so you are a very giving loving generous person okay but do not allow people to take your kindness for weakness or to run over you in some type of way here okay call upon your angels for help for support okay and try not to over exert yourself okay so that you don't burn out, okay? But you are a star nonetheless here, okay? This comes from um, Archangel uh, Jophiel. Um, a dream come true. Believe in yourself. The end of a difficult situation, okay? This talks about that change coming into your life here, okay? You're awakened. You're illuminated. You're very smart, okay? And there's change and sudden wealth that is coming in for you. You have been faithful and dedicated and loyal to your work, your craft, okay? We have the 10 of Raphael here, okay? This talks about love and blessings filling your life, okay? Harmonious relationships. Um, some of you may have harmonious relationships with family. Some of you may have harmonious relationships with someone new coming into your life. But it speaks to a happily ever after. Okay? For those of you who this is going to be a lover coming into your life, I want you to look very closely. You see how I feel like you're going to meet this person out in nature. You see how they're at this park here. And, like, she's sitting here. Like, there's this picnic here. Okay? And... She's meeting this guy here, okay? I feel like this would be a blended family. I feel like you, you see how the kids are playing together? And y'all are just talking here, but it's out in nature at a park or something like that. I feel like you have a child and he has a child, okay? And your kids are going to get along um, very well together, okay? And y'all are going to have a very harmonious relationship as well, okay? For that, So that's for those of you that that is for here. So we have the two of Gabrielle here, okay? Spirit is telling you to make bold and ambitious choices. A great progress is possible. Important relationships with people who share your vision, okay? And that's what Spirit is talking about, doing something today that your future self will thank you for. And this is why in the um, distant horizon, the very near future, you're coming into some type of high honor and you are going to be the topic of conversation amongst a lot of people here, okay? Um, you're going to rejoice in celebration, okay? Um, there's emotional fulfillment happening for you as well as happiness, success, recognition, and um, enthusiasm and some of everything else, okay, guys? So I do hope that this reading has given you the truth and the clarity that you were seeking pertaining to a situation that you are dealing with. I thank you all for listening and for watching. If you would be so kind to so please like, share, and subscribe, it would be greatly, greatly appreciated. For those of you who would like to contact me, you can do so at tiff.diamond.36 at gmail.com. You can also locate me on Facebook at Tiffany Letish Diamond Ziegler, or you can follow me on Instagram, which is shinebrightlikeadiamond36 with an underscore between each word. For those of you who are interested in donating to the channel, it is greatly, greatly appreciated. You can do so through Cash App, which is dollar sign a tip diamond 36, or through PayPal, which is paypal.me slash add 36 diamonds. As always, guys, take care of yourselves, take care of each other, but most of all, take care of your baby, honey. Remember, this is a wicked, wicked world that we live in. There is wickedness in high places, and there is evil that is lurking around each and every corner, honey, even in a neighborhood near you. So y'all watch your surroundings. Watch the company you keep. Watch the surroundings and the company in which your children are in as well. And considering the fact that you never know when someone may betray you, backstab you, try to hurt you or harm you, honey, keep you some protection on you. Y'all stay awake, stay aware, stay vigilant, and stay prepared. Because if you stay ready, you ain't got to get ready, baby. Until the next time, peace, love, and light. Namaste. I am that I am created in the image of God.